Hi everybody, I hope everybody is doing really well. Um, I hope everyone is enjoying uh, seeing what tools um, I brought back from this uh, my new friend. Um, so basically, um, I bought five tools here um, and I've never seen any of them up until, not in person anyway, up until recently. Um, so the first one, I actually ended up buying two of these and you may have seen if you watched another video, this is a Crescent tool a uh, double ended wrench um, and this is a four and a six inch i've never seen one before the crescent tools are extremely rare in the uk i have had a couple of generic single crescent tools like that possibly but they're all damaged and you know they're very rare and um, so this is a crescent tools four and a six inch and i think this is nicer condition than the other one which is fabulous and um, the next one i'm assuming is a victor wrench it just says on it extra jaws, extra jaws, 25 cents with the teeth. Um, and then obviously on this side, it has taken applicant form. Maybe that's something to do with the patent. Um, um, this is, is just, it's obviously it's got a little um, screw. I'll go into this in another video. Um, but this is a, uh, it has a, uh, a, a die handle. So you've got dies, which is absolutely fabulous. Um, so you can use it as a die handle as well, as um as as a wrench. Um, it's just a multi tool. Um, of all multi tools, really. Um, it's still got it's kind of got its chrome finish still. Um, I'm not sure when this dates, but I would have thought the nineteen twenties or before. I would have thought if I had to guess. Um, it's a fabulous wrench with a die inside it. Um, super cool. Um. Yeah, so I don't know what to say about that other than it's absolutely fantastic. Um, I know that Scoutcraft has done a video on one of these multi-tools. Um, a Dayton, is it? Ohio? Uh, Never stall wrench. And obviously it's fabulous. It's got a set of grips. It's got two square nuts probably for taps. Um, it's got, um, on this side, it's got like a pry bar screwdriver. And on this side it has... Um, I put a, um, a, a pause foot uh, pry bar on the end there. Um, obviously, it's got the wrench. Um, um, I'm imagining they might be a wire cutter as well. Um, absolutely amazing. Now, I've seen, I know that John Fix has got a wonderful example of one of these. I know John has done one, so I'm not sure how common they are in the US, if they're a reasonably easy one to find. But in the UK, I've never seen one. And you believe me, I've looked. So this is a Dayton, Ohio multi-tool, never store wrench. Just fabulous. Drop forged steel. So I was super happy to pick that up. What a fabulous example. Um, the next wrench is a Sergeant MFG and Co. Company, is it? Buffalo, New York. And it's the 8-inch Sergeant wrench. Now this wrench, for some reason, has some sort of cantilever here. Not sure what that does. I mean, I'll have to test it out in the rest wrench tester to see if there's any benefit. But it's got some sort of mechanism. Maybe it gives you a little bit more leverage. I don't know. Um, and this has an offset, kind of unusual thread. Um, really kind of cool indeed. So that's a super wrench. I was super happy to find that one. I think that'll polish up lovely. A little bit of Scout Crafter Red, eh? And that'll be a stunner. So, yeah, absolutely amazing. Super happy to find that one. Now, I do have one of these Victor wrenches, but in poor condition. But this one is absolutely a beauty. Uh, it's, uh, is it Cruta and Company? Newark, um, which is where I bought this from, Newark, England. Um, but this is Newark... Um, New Hampshire is it USA not too sure um, pattern um, May 16th 03 so in 1903 uh, forged high carbon steel um, it's showing a little bit of rust but I still think it's an, an absolutely amazing example um, it, it's beautiful and I love the actual um, the the screw the way it's like it's just absolutely stunning so it's hard to choose between those two. This one's absolutely fabulous. This one's completely different, but it has the, the tap handle. So 
yeah amazing so yeah so basically um this is this is a, a super cool super cool collection um again um i picked out most of his american tools because that's what i i've seen on youtube videos and that's what i really really like the look of and they're kind of exotic in the uk we just don't find them so i couldn't believe it when i saw my look so so we have the uh, crescent wrench we have the uh not sure the name 25 cents extra draw wrench we've got the uh, multi-tool we've got the um sort of ratcheting weird design cantilevered wrench and then we've got this other victor wrench um which is also cool so you know uh this is a sergeant and that one was a never stall so if you could only have one which one would you say is the coolest for me oh i've got i think those are so cool but because there's two it kind of makes you feel like they're very common so I think I'd say the never store wrench because I love multi tools and this is the multi tool of multi tools. It's absolutely fabulous. Um, so yeah, put in the de description, which ones you think is the coolest. Um, and don't forget to catch the other videos before you make your guess. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.